to the famous Jawas series, where we will tell you about the lives of some very famous Jawas within the Jawa community. Over the many centuries many new technologies have been brought to Tatooine by the colonists. It was only a few decades ago when Tatooine finally got connected to the internet. From that time on it was only a matter of time before the native Jawas would also discover the internet and start using it. One of these Jawas is the online Jawa content creator slash influencer, Jawa Arista. Jawa Arista grew up as a normal Jawa. She spent her days scavenging scrap across Tatooine. One day she went to Mozilla to trade some of her scrap to the locals, and it was during this trip she discovered the internet. Browsing the web Jawa Arista started to learn about a lot of things that were previously unknown to her, from cute cat videos on YouTube to Jawa Rule 34. Jawa Arista had an epiphany. Teaching young Jawas how to scavenge has always been a daunting task, especially with many Jawa clans constantly on the move traveling across Tatooine. Jawa Arista however realized that the internet could be a good solution for this problem. She petitioned the Jawa Council to install Wi-Fi on every sand crawler, and they agreed. Jawa Arista launched a channel on YouTube. Her channel almost immediately became very popular in the Jawa community. Her main series of videos is called, The Academy. Welcome to The Academy, a series focused on the basics of being a Jawa. To scavenge grade 9 scrap you will want to own a decent circa 180 scrap scanner. You can usually find one lying around in any colonist settlement. Just be careful the inhabitants don't catch you borrowing it. In the series she teaches new and old Jawas alike all the tips and tricks of scavenging and fixing various machinery and droids. I have always enjoyed creating guides and content ever since I started scavenging myself and realized how many fellow Yawas were out there who shared my love for scavenging. I started making guides for my friends and clan mates, so we could work together better by understanding all the different aspects of scavenging better. She will also regularly stream on Twitch, streaming her own adventures when out scavenging in the Dune Sea, but also popular Jawa video games like Jawa Dating Simulator 2021, Hello Yawas, before I start on my scavenging trip today, I have some scary news to share. Taxi droid TD-98 was found destroyed near its crashed taxi speeder in the outlaw's den. And while the galactic cops have not confirmed anything yet, many are speculating it is the latest victim of the scary Shanini killer. A fan favorite of the fashion show streams, where her Jawa subscribers could show of their favorite outfits. This is a really nice Yahweh outfit. This Yahweh robe is a unique version that is found in the northeastern Dune Sea. The hood is a common one, available from any Yahweh vendor. The belt is the crafted grade 9 one. That is a very nice outfit, Nick Nick. Well done. Who is next? I love seeing my fellow Yahweh's creativity from their unique outfits or the various things they make from scrap. Jawa Arista is of course not the only Jawa influencer slash content creator. In recent years there has been a boom of Jawa content creators and influences popping up, including content creators like Jawa Ru, Peter the Jawa, and Doody, and also popular Jawa podcasts like Utini Cast, and of course also Kara, who runs this very channel slash Jawa face. I was able to have a holonet call with Jawa Ria and Peter the Jawa. I used to run a Yawa radio station. One day when I was out in the Dunsi scavenging, I decided to record myself. I noticed a lot of young Yawas asking about our history and why certain things are the way they are. So I started my channel Yawa Lore and More to post informative videos. Jawa Ria makes videos about Jawa Lore and More. Hey everyone, this video is to explain the origin of the word Utini. I started streaming on Twitch, and I realized I love entertaining Yavas. I just want to make Yavas laugh, 
and entertain them. I also run the Yava Center channel. Peter the Jawor can often be found streaming his scavenging adventures and uploading videos to Jawor Central. Yona Put. Hello guys, my name is Peter, and welcome back to another video. In this video we will take a new look at the upcoming changes to scavenging gear and equipment. So what is next for Jao Arista? She has started making and selling cool Jao merchandise, including some nice limited edition Jao pins. She is also planning to organize a convention next summer called Jao Con. I am so excited for Jao Con. It will be an amazing opportunity for all of us Jao content creators to meet up and meet our fans. We are going to rent a spot in the Dune Sea and put up a large tent. It will be awesome. I am so excited for Yavacom. I already booked a flight for next summer. I hope there will be a bad pit. Let's hope Jaworcon will be a big success. Do not miss the final episode of Famous Jaws, as we will reveal how a very famous individual in the galaxy is in fact secretly a Jaworcon. Until next time. What is this? Utini. This information, it can't be. Jane Goodall has to see this.